calls, y'all. It's time for some follow up calls, y'all. Follow up, follow up. Pick up the phone, let's go. Hello, hello. Can you hear me? I don't know. What's going on? I'm about to do this call right quick, see if somebody answers. He may not answer, he may answer. If he does, we'll have a video. If he don't answer, we'll end it. So we're gonna give a call to Toby. Looks like he has a three bedroom, two and a half bath out in beautiful St. Charles, Missouri. They wanna get 350,000. Uh, the reason for selling says money talks. So this probably, uh, this person may not have much motivation, but we're about to dig for motivation to figure out if there's something there. Uh, says it doesn't need any repairs, but in the additional notes, it says they're getting it repaired. So I don't know what that's about. Um, the roof is about four or five years old. It's homeowner occupied, but this came from a list that we pulled from a vacant list. So according to the post office, it's vacant, but it seems to be occupied by the owner. Or maybe they moved out. We'll dig deeper into this for Mr. Toby. So I'm gonna call him up right now. If this video helps you out or gives you some questions and learns you a lesson, give it a thumbs up, give it a like, give it a share if you care. Let's see if we got Toby. Uh, let's see, we wanna call him from here. Toby, what's your name, boy? Toby. Hey, Toby. Yes. This is Chris. You spoke to my assistant earlier today in regards to your house over on uh, Concordia. How are you? Yeah, doing pretty good. How you doing? Good. Did you have a couple moments? Yeah. Great. Yeah, I just wanted to follow up with you. I'm actually the person that buys houses. That was my assistant you spoke to earlier, like I said. And I was just looking over the notes here. Uh, looks like this house doesn't need anything as far as repairs, right? It's just a pretty decent house. Just want to sell it? No, no, no. Uh, it, it's being repaired. I uh, had water damage last year, so we're, it's getting all fixed up. But uh, my, my first question is, is like, how, how, how did my phone number get to you and your assistant? Well, it's something called Google. So they actually, not necessarily Google, but the internet knows everything, to be honest with you, Toby. There's really no way to hide. They find me, they find you. If somebody want to find you, they really can track you down. But your house came up. No, that's... No, I no, I understand that, but it, it was just kind of like uh, it, it, it. Before you had to pay for a service or something like that, and then uh, I understand Google's a thing, but uh, I didn't know Google would send out you know gifts people's phone numbers out that own a house. Oh yeah, we pay for services, so yeah, we we spend a lot of money buying houses and marketing and all mm -hmm. the things. We do business in real life, so we're actually looking to buy, not just to say hi. Okay. All right. So yeah. So you said it had some water damage last year. What was it? Pipe burst or something? Or yeah, yeah. Oh wow, that's no good. So uh, are you planning on fixing it up and selling it, or you want to sell it as is? Oh no, that that was the thing. It's like I, I wasn't looking into selling it, and and so that that's kind of why I was like, I don't I don't understand how uh, my my name and number comes up if I'm I, I never advertised it or anything. I just get random messages every now and then. Yeah, so, so it, it was kind of like you, uh, you and your assistant called me. So I'm, and I told her, uh, money, money talks and bullshit walk. So it, <laughs> <I'm>, <laughs> I know that's right. Not, right. You know. I'm not hurting for money. I'm not hurting for a house either. <laughs> I know that's right. Especially around Christmas time, say money talks. So yeah, we're definitely looking to yeah. buy. So you don't really have any real reason to sell it. Am I getting that right? No, not not at all. No, nope. and in fact, that's why I said you guys were you, you guys contacted me. I didn't I didn't search out anybody. Okay, yeah, it just came up as a showed as a vacant house, I guess, through the postal records or something like that. So that's why when somebody got a vacant house, we end up you know reaching out to them see if they want to sell it. It wasn't vacant that long. I mean, uh, we were uh, living in Qatar for uh, I was there for two years, but my my wife was only there for a year. Oh wow, you're in the so military. That house wasn't vacant. Uh, it used to be. Oh, okay. Yeah, I did six years in the army myself. Okay. Cool. So, so, you, so this house you don't want to sell, and you don't have any others that you do, would want to sell. 
No, uh, this, this is my uh, main primary house right here. Okay. I mean, it, it's not that I don't want to sell it, but like I told her, I was like 350, 400, and, and it's y'all. <laughs> I know that's right. Hey, you never know. We we've done deals like that. You know, some people say, yeah, "I was I never wow. thought about it, but I will sell it," and we end up buying our house. So it happens all the time. Wow. So you, but yeah, I know. I know that's way out of the price, or you know, the market price, or whatever it is. So I, you know, I I, I can't expect anybody to want to buy it because, like I said, yeah, it's not it's not for sale. Not looking to sell it, you know. But uh, like I said, uh, but the right price will. Uh, well, you know, you know what I mean. Yeah, the right price will make me move. Million dollars, I'm out of here. I'll sell mine for a million, too. <laughs> That's right. So, all That's right, right, Toby, I'll let you get back to your holiday. Uh, sorry for disturbing you, and uh, I'll just put in the notes here that you're not interested, okay? All right, awesome. All right, thank you. All right, have a good holiday. All right, you too. Bye. So there you have it. Zero motivation. Disqualify the person immediately. Don't waste too much time. Ask questions. Are you sure you don't want to sell it? You really don't have a reason that you want to sell it? You don't have any other properties that you want to sell? I probably could have pitched in there something about, oh, you know anybody? But, you know, after five, six minutes, it's kind of like beating a dead horse. So this person has zero motivation. So what do we do with them? Move on. We're not looking to create motivation. We're looking to find people who have motivation and give them a solution to their problem. So hopefully this video helped you out. Give it a thumbs up, give it a like, give it a share. Post in the comments below, would you have asked something different? Would you have done something different with this call other than what I did? Uh, I'm just follow up with a guy and you know, he don't really have any pain and he's not looking really to do any gain. So uh, that's gonna do it for now. Don't forget to follow me on all social media outlets at Chris Monroe STL, that's Snapchat, that's Twitter, that's Instagram, that's Facebook, that's YouTube, that's TikTok, that's Clubhouse, there is no Twitter, there's X, we're on X, and we're next, so follow me there, at Chris Monroe STL, do what you do, be who you be, and I'll see you before you see me. Find more leads than you can even process. That's multiple listing service. That's the MLS for you real estate agents. Absentee owner information. Find the cash buyers and flippers in any market nationwide. Pull a pre-foreclosure list. And don't forget, you got to find those comps. Get nationwide access with multiple filters. Powered by PropStream at WokeSource.com. Get your seven-day free trial today. WokeSource.com. That's WokeSource.com. You may have heard the saying, the fortunes are in the follow-up. Now there's a brand new system that is great to help you cold call, text message, drop voicemails, and so much more, all automated. You don't have to remember anything, just set it and forget it. All you have to do is speak to people. Check it out, WokeReply.com. It's a multi-touch marketing campaign where you can schedule to send text, voicemail, email, and even live calls all on autopilot. Check it out today, WokeReply.com. That's WokeReply.com.